This is the uh, 4089 rhythm generator thing. As you can hear, it's making some nice changing rhythms by itself. Initially, I was going to divide the uh, output of the f uh, what's it called again? The the exclusive OR gates. I was going to divide the output of the exclusive OR gates, but it was too crazy and it just led to a mess. But as you can hear, there's a nice little sort of tune developing, and it changes and develops. And that is because I'm dividing the original clock frequency, which is that nice little flashy light just there, instead of a crazy frequency. And this is the crazy frequency. Look at that. Some nice sort of pulse width modulation stuff going on there. That's the uh, output of the exclusive OR gates. The 4070, that's where it's called. I'm going to change that a little bit and it'll get crazier. Ooh, craziness. And you can hear it changes the sound as well. in a little my intention with the uh, 4070 I'm going to change the clock speed a bit my intention with the 4070 was to get some kind of percussive nasty sound which I could use to make a rhythm like this I'm going to try changing some of the binary inputs to the 4089, which are coming from the frequency divider, which is uh, dividing the clock, as I mentioned just before. Huh. Oh, I see, that's a bigger one, that's why. I'm going to put this in a uh, faster division, see what happens. Sorry if this video is kind of dark, but uh, I ran out of plugs in my... Oh, you can't even see the plugs. Anyway, there are some plugs here, and there aren't enough to plug in a light as well as all the other stuff. Okay, I'm pretty sure you're getting bored of this now. I'll just try and tune the oscilloscope in again to the waveform because you get some really nice, interesting sort of pulse width. Oh, look at that. You see? Nice, interesting pulse width modulation sort of stuff out of the exclusive OR gates.